We go for the full Monty here, which is all horror, all the time. This is one of the most unique experiences that I've been to in many years. Terror of Tallahassee is a local business in that sense. We're not open all year long, so we definitely try our best to focus in on that one month. So you've come to explore our little digs, have you? <laughs> Don't expect to make it through it one piece. Very few do. Oh, after you. I was a, a film school student, and I very much enjoyed the fact that Harrisburg is surrounded by farms, and these farms had a ton of haunted hay rides and haunted houses, and so Halloween would come around, and of course I enjoy that sort of thing. So when I came back here, I was thinking, why don't we do that here in Tallahassee? And I set up this big elaborate haunted scene at my house for trick-or-treaters, and I waited, and I waited, and I waited, and not a single trick-or-treater came. The whole thing had been wasted, so I said, okay, that does it. Next time, if they won't come to me, I'm gonna go to them. So I rented a restaurant building on North Monroe Street, we started it there, and we got the crowds, and it just it accumulated from there. When working in a haunted house, you see a lot of different opportunities to expand your own personal skills. As far as my job specifically over here, other than scaring, there's a lot of things that go in the background, so you end up learning a lot of things on the way. There are so many uh, people who bring a, a, a special expertise that I don't know how the heck we ran into. I'm in charge of uh, the construction lead, the scenic design, I, I laid out the floor plan, you know, blind turns, switchbacks hidden spots, those are things that the, uh, the, the customer's not actually l looking for, but unconsciously they know it's there as part of the anticipation. I believe part of what makes uh, a haunted house a really good attraction, um, aside from the visual nature of it, the, the props, the music, the painting, the, the, aside from those, what really binds it all together is the combination of actors and actresses that form to make that haunted house. This whole place is basically a community theater. So we just open our doors and invite these people to come and do what they do best. Most of it is just passion and people putting themselves into it. And that's what makes it unique too. When you have the people who are good at interacting with people, you want to put those people in the forefront because that's what makes this place a lot different from corporate haunts. <laughs> My personal type of uh, scare factor is what we call the ambush. Basically, um, I'll, I'll have a, a costume or something menacing at first. I'll go in very close, right up to a person's face, and then just go away into the darkness. They don't know if you're coming back. Maybe he's around the corner. And that's the kind of things that you want to make them question their own personal safety. I love haunted houses and I love being scared um, simply because it gives you a feeling, at least for me, it gives me a feeling of being alive. People remember fear and uh, that's what this place does and that's probably a strange thing to be proud about but we instill a lot of memories in a lot of people. There is a science behind fear and that is um, use every single tool and element available to create that fear for people. That's the fun of it for me is coming up with something new for that. It's the element of surprise that throws people off. What's different between when they enter and when they leave? Their heart rate and their breathing, okay? When they come in, they're either giggling or they're uh, a little nervous. When they leave, they sound like they've just finished their exercise program. When you get a lot of the flight or fight, fear response, the cortisol, the adrenaline, the norepinephrine, those are the things which we strive to increase. It's that anticipation of what, what is next. That is what gets the scare. Halloween for us is a celebration of being a child again, being able to open that fun and allowing ourselves to be able to invite people into our little world of fun. We actually been to Halloween Horror Nights and we thought this is actually pretty comparable for what you pay for it. It's much better. We heard about it from mutual friends just who have been here over the years and they told us it was really scary so we wanted to check it out. And we've never been and it was actually really cool, so we came back this year. Between 60 and 75% of our audience are people who keep coming back. Yeah. We will definitely be coming back next year. Yeah, we'll come back every year.
be afraid. But don't be afraid to be afraid.